Hi guys, welcome to Skellig here, we are off for the first episode of Super Mario Maker My Custom Courses. Uh, this is pretty much all the courses that I have right now, and well, there's no point going to sample courses, I pretty much have them all already. But, yeah, um, as I've already mentioned, this is pretty much where I'm going to showcase my stages, and, uh, talk about how I came to be and stuff while I'm playing through them. And the first one that I made is actually, well, other than the tutorial stage that you're forced to save, is, uh, follow the coins and pick a path. Let's begin. Now, because this game, obviously, is a little bit of on the small side, I've lowered the bit rate of, uh, the, the recording on Watsu Game Cap HD Pro, just to see if this would stop glitching, because it seems to be doing quite often nowadays, for whatever reason. So I've lowered it by about 5,000 bit rate or whatever. But anyway, enough about that. Let's get back to the stage here. So as you can see, follow the coins, pick a path. I'm following these coins right now, and it's a very small, thin path. And this, yeah, the first half is kind of wall jump heavy, which, which is why I chose this, uh, this style of game, of Mario game, which is obviously new Super Mario Bros. So, let's just do that. There's a spring here, in case if you want to get back up easily when you're down that way. So, I'll do that just in case. There we go. And, uh, yeah, so, following the coins, there's, uh, this was just a level that I built when I was starting out the game, because when you start off the game, you have got, you've got, like, nothing to work with. There's a mushroom down there, just because why not? It's there, it's there to tease you. I'll show you why that's a thing later. But yeah, I was trying to think, I want to make a compact stage with all that I have so far, because I couldn't make any of the stages I wanted to make. I tried a few stages, I couldn't do it. So that's a thing. If you hit this star block, this star will actually follow those coins down into this hole here. So if you grab it, you want to get out. You can't go down that way where those coins are, because it's too thin. I mean, you could, but then you won't be able to get through the rest of the way. So, oh, get up there. There we go. Smash away through. Okay, I took a hit, so... Oh, god damn it! Basically, there's a mushroom in that area, so if you don't make it to the end, you can hit that block, and the, that mushroom will be waiting for it. Of course, I suck at my own stage. <laughs> what a great way to start off this mini-series. It's just I couldn't pull off that wall jump, so I'm just gonna speedrun it, because when I speedrun this stage, it's a lot easier for me. It's just... It, the only reason why I did that is just to show you that if you... If you Smash that and miss the star, it will go into that hole for you. There we go, that went way better. If, you, Like I said, if you take a hit from like the last couple of enemies at the bottom here, you can get a mushroom from here. That will allow you to continue. Otherwise, you can just go back on yourself, but whatever. I'll show that way off in a second. So now, if you try to go back on yourself this way, you can't. There's no running space or jumping space for you to get under this block when you're big. So that's kind of a thing. So... Yeah, and there's no hidden blocks in that little pit between this little bit and the flag because I didn't have that unlocked yet. I didn't have hidden blocks unlocked yet, so that's kind of a thing. So let me start over this course, and then I can show you the other direction. So, okay, I can't seem to do this. What you're supposed to do is jump up here. You're supposed to jump up- there we go, okay, somehow I couldn't do that for a second there. Oh, no, I don't want to grab this. I don't know what's, uh, why I'm having trouble here at the moment, because I didn't have trouble last time when I played this- When I played this at this stage, I went this way to complete the level to upload it, so I don't know why I'm having trouble now, I might have to fix that. But yeah, as you can see, you can't go down there to get that mushroom because it's a tease. You can't go down that way because that's just a block for you to smash. You can still get the coins from here, though. On this question mark here. The other one's supposed to be an exclamation mark, but then coins come off it for whatever reason. Just to let you know, hey, you can get up here. But we can't get up there, and if we try and ground pound to get this start, it'll just poof out of existence. So what do we do? We go down here. And as you can see, even if you were big, you can't come up this way. So... Because you won't be able to escape this. Now, there's one up here, just as a pity, I guess. And, uh, yeah, now that we actually have a fire flower, we can smash our way out. Makes you feel a little bit better, because that's the only way you can get a fire flower here. You can smash your way up this way with some excellent wall jumps, but then enemies will land on you before you can even use your fire flower. It's to try and tempt you. But other than that, that's the level. So let me go into the editor here. There's not really much else to talk about. Because, like I said, as this was my first stage, I didn't have a lot to work with. So, 
So now I'm in the editor. Of course, like I said, I'll have to fix this bit up here. But, as you can see, it's just, uh, just a bunch of coins. That's really all it is. I mean, there are tons of enemies here, but I have noticed that these four Coopers, and maybe a couple of these Goombas as well, with the plants on their heads, of course. <laughs> it's like Pikmin. <laughs> but, I have noticed that they don't seem to spawn when I approach. I don't, um, there obviously is a limit on how many enemies that could be put on the screen at once, but if that's the case, I don't know why it allows me to actually put that many on in the first place. There's also a jumping piranha plant here to catch you out. You might be thinking that, oh, he's on the floor, but no, nope, boing, he snipes you, so that's a thing. Yeah, so there wasn't really much else to do here. Like I said, I'll have to fix this and then re-upload the stage later. Hopefully it will stay with the same uh, ID. If not, I'll put it in the description just in case. But yeah, it's just a starting off stage for when I first got this game. Very haphazard. I pretty much had up to ha um, up to the one-up mushroom on number two when I was creating this stage. So that's kind of how that works. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed this first uh, very short mini episode of Super Mario Maker. Uh, my custom levels. And I hope you uh, play the game. There's the ID for this course if you want to play it yourself. Hope you enjoyed this video, and I hope you enjoy the stage that I have created.